Today we're looking at work and careers. What do you want to do? What do you want to be? Or what do you wish you had done? I want to be a submarine driver. I would like to be um, a shopkeeper. When I grow up, I'd like to be a author and I'd also like to illustrate my own books. When I grow up, I want to be an actress. When I grow up, I'd like to be a hairdresser. I would like to be an engineer. I like to um, own a pet shop. In your opinion, does school adequately prepare pupils for the real world? We try very hard to prepare everybody for the real world and, and what we say is that, is that we hope that they will leave the school with a set of values and a, and a, and a, and a way of behaving uh, that will take them through adult life. Did you get any career advice at school? No, I got no careers advice at school, as far as I can remember. I think there was a careers advice service at Cambridge when I was doing my certificate of education, uh, but I didn't use it. But at school now, we do put children through a huge range of different careers tests. Uh, there is a form of psychometric testing, and it comes back, and they're all very excited to read about what they're going to do. Um, uh, and, and for the vast majority, what they actually do bears very little resemblance to what comes out of those tests. Ultimately, I think I'd like to be a barrister, but um, I'm thinking perhaps I might go headhunter route. I think it's more sociable, a bit more, a bit more fun, really. Uh, well, at the moment, my goals would probably um, be continuing on in um, college and trying to get as far as I can. Hopefully, um, getting a doctorate at the end of it. I, I, I think it's very good to have some idea of where you're heading in life and I think probably goals do allow people to solidify um, their life. Looking back, are you happy with the career decisions you made? I, I don't think there's any stage of it that I regret. I enjoyed it all enormously. But I suppose the bit that I was least enthusiastic about was actually teaching the subject uh, in class. I was much better at the pastoral side, the management side, and that's why I became firstly a housemaster and then a headmaster. I worked in the university department. I wanted to do horticulture. My parents persuaded me to do a secretarial course, which I did. I've just done various things. University, um, I went into local government uh, in law, um, worked in for a pressure group. I work too hard. I work much too hard. I don't get rewarded enough for it either. I should be earning at least £10,000 more every year for the amount of work that I do. I get up every morning at 4am and I'm absolutely exhausted. But I enjoy what I do at the same time. So it's a balance, isn't it?